Today's Ask Me Anything goes out to Springheart, who says, my dog is six months old and he's scared to even go outside. How can I teach him to go outside and do his business outside? I always have him, I always have him to either carry him, he's really heavy, four flights of stairs, <clears throat> or drag him down so he would go down himself. Sometimes it feels like I'm abusing him because he stops in a small corner he finds outside and tries to hide. Maybe he has had bad experiences from his old owner, but it's really hard to teach him. I tried walking him with my other dog, but it still don't work. And it's really hard to walk both when, well, so, okay, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna help you out with this. First of all, your other dog is not helping the situation, so don't, don't, don't do it. I would bring this dog, I would, I would only feed this dog outside, right? I would make sure that the dog sees that being outside is a really good thing. This is tough love, but I mean, what an amazing gift to give the dog to be able to accept being outside, right? You don't wanna drag the dog, you know, pick the dog up, go down. I mean, you're, what are you gonna, for, 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 for 10 years, carry this dog down four flights of stairs, you're not going to do it. So I would make sure the dog is nice and hungry, get some cookies, you know, one little cookie or one little kibble on each stair going down. I would throw a party. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. I wouldn't go and say, it's okay. It's okay. That's the wrong tone, right? Saying, oh, it's okay. It's okay. Don't worry. It's okay. It's okay. Come on. Let's go. Don't be afraid. That's reinforcing the negative behavior, but getting excited, come on, we're going to go outside. Let's go. Yeah. What a good girl. Good boy. Come on. Let's go. And then having your treats go you know, going down the stairs and having the dog be excited, throw a party. Be happy yourself about getting the dog outside and I think the dog will be happier to go outside and we'll start to condition those behaviors to being, or at least associate those behaviors with something positive, like getting to go outside and having a great time. Throw a ball for him, throw treats for him, do something to make the dog's brain spark into having a good time being outside. And that should change the dynamic for you and your dog. But don't bring the other dog for now. That's my suggestion to you. Got a question? Ask me anything. Check out my brand new course online for training to become a dog trainer. How to be a dog trainer is not hard, pretty simple. And I break it down in a 25 plus hour program with over 150 videos of theory and practical application at shelterdogtraining.com. And as always, check out my website, robertcabral.com for all the best online dog training available anywhere.